We're the Sugar Dandies. For those who take their dancing seriously and prefer a partner of the same sex, it's a bit of a shock. A proposal by the British Dance Council that in open competition, a couple be defined as one man and one lady. They're saying that this is to regulate the system of ballroom dancing. For me, that's the biggest load of baloney I have ever heard. This is a man's world! Robin Windsor is one of the star dancers on Strictly, happy to dance with whoever. And he feels in an age of equality, gender should not be an issue when it comes to judging. However, Victoria Brown's a dance teacher. Her dance studio, a place that doesn't judge anyone on colour, creed or sex. But when you're dancing at the very highest level, where every tiny detail of balance, execution and connection is being judged, can you really compare same-sex couples with mixed-sex couples? If I'm a, a lady in this position, I'm standing, not only I'm on four inch heels, three and a half inch heels, which is different. I'm holding myself different. I've probably got more elegant hands. So it's going to be, there is going to be a difference in the look, what, what we're doing. I'm balancing on a heel. So the heels definitely uh, have a disadvantage for the lady when we're dancing. There's absolutely no advantage of same sex couples dancing together as far as strength goes. Boring dancing is all about technique. Dancers like Victoria and Zoltan, yes, he really is called Zoltan, disagree. Even tiny differences in strength and stamina, they say, really matter. Kick, kick, boom, boom, kick, kick. But for Robin, whose memories are of growing up, often being the only boy in a sea of girls, all that matters for him are the steps. David Silito, BBC News.